Alright guys, what up? Welcome back to Legendary Edition. Now, I'm starting this all over from the beginning. We're going to be going down my entire mod list so you guys can know exactly what I'm using and we don't have to go through this uh, BS of what mods you're using. Even though I do have a list, uh, I just want to explain to you in detail what some of these things do. So, first off, before we even start, I just want to say I created this mod. Hold up, let me pause it real quick. So, one of my characters that I made in Special Edition, I decided to make her an NPC and Legendary Edition. I also give her ownership to a horse and a travel package. So, when she's not in your party, she will travel and go around the map to all different places of, you know, Skyrim, wherever I place markers. Now, originally, she would get on the horse and just sit there. She would not move. I started a new game and now she moves so i don't know maybe something got corrupt anyway long story short i'm just happy it works there she goes hey sophie bye sophie all right so that's my npc and her horse and now she's gonna she's gonna go to like white run and windhelm and run around and stuff like that it's really freaking cool anyway so there's this one mod called old geared up derev or something like that and the main reason why I picked this mod was because I wanted to display my shield on my back whenever I uh, sheathed it. Um, this mod is supposed to do that. It's going to give you a whole bunch of different options. You can have coin purse, ingredient satchel, potions. You can change which model of potions that appear. And all of these things will appear on your waist. Scroll, torch, even quest items like the white file, the elder scroll, Azura star, all of that stuff could um, apply onto your character. And uh, the thing about it is that if it's uh, occupying a slot that something else is using it, you can go into the MCM right here, and then you can actually check the slots and see which armor pieces you know are taking up the slots. And then you can go and choose a slot like 46, 47, 48, and 49, which are blank for an example. And you can apply, you know, whatever item that you want to display that's not displaying so i just want to show you guys something real quick i'm actually going to go and enable these miscellaneous armors enable miscellaneous armor display and i'm going to go to these potions and hopefully these things appear all right so i had to uh like turn off the items and turn it back on for it to work but there you go as you can see it's working you got your three different potion types on the uh, hip there and knife in the back satchel coin purse I have everything activated and uh, here's another thing that you could do I'm gonna show you that you could change the models really quickly so I'm gonna go back to mod configuration all geared up uh, what is it miscellaneous player and then I could go and I could actually change these potions from like greater to or we'll just skip to ultimate ultimate there you go and now the models will change to the ultimate. They will scale, you know, so that it it uh, doesn't grow too big, even though ultimate potions are bigger than this, but it's gonna stay the same size so it matches on your hip. There's gonna be some clipping depending on what outfit you're wearing. As you can see, I got the uh, basic standard clothes and they're clipping with the potions. So anyway, back to the reason why I downloaded this mod in the first place was to get a shield on my back, which this mod is supposed to do so as you can see i'm just default i got the default starter outfit you know when you use an alternate start and you're a patron at the end so um here's my shield right i go to sheath it and it does not go onto my back uh so it's really annoying it's the main reason why i downloaded the mod was to get that uh all the other features are working but this one sadly is not so i thought i'd just show it off anyway before i go and uninstall oh so before i go on to the next one i just want to say that you can also activate this on npcs i'm not exactly sure which npcs are affected by this i know that uh my companion i just noticed has some potions on her hip so uh, I believe it's working on companions at least. I don't know about all NPCs. It seems like something that would be a little bit performance heavy. As you can see, there's a potion on. The thing is, it only displays one of them. Uh, and she's got the coin purse on her back, but her butt is so big that it's clipping. And uh, yeah, so it does work on NPCs. Alright, so this, this mod is actually pretty freaking cool. So I was wondering why the heck my companion only had 
the health potion now you can see she has all three it's because she only had the health potion in her inventory so if if i go and you see she got those potions of uh magicka if i go into her inventory i need to trade some things with you and i take that potion of magicka away it comes off of her hip as you can see now she's got the health and the stamina but no magicka so that's really freaking so one more thing before i go because i know somebody's gonna mention this um this is not even a proper showcase or whatever this is just me messing around with the mod and trying to figure it out i have set my favorite weapons to an iron sword dwarven battle axe and a white run guard shield and none of these things will display like unless i have them e as uh, immediately equipped to me so i have the sword you know equipped to me so when i sheath it it will show but if I go to like the Dwarven Battle Axe, it will be removed. I think what this mod is supposed to do is the sword is still supposed to show, even though I have the axe equipped. It's just, however, it's just not working for me. Let me try to beat this giant's behind real quick. Everything for Look, even the giant has a satchel. The giant has a satchel. The giant is geared up. Oh, he's strong. You a big boy. You supposed to drop already. All right, we have to check his inventory to see what's causing that satchel to appear. All right, guys, hurry up. Just taking y'all so long. And then this guy kills me. Good job. Good job, Farkas.